Hello, so I had another week at the Boys and Girls Club. Um, so a few things that stuck out to me. Um, so these girls, this group of girls actually got in a fight um, about food stamps. And so it was two um, black girls and then like two or three white girls. Um, that are in this friend group and I guess one of them made a comment about like food stamps and it was like incorrect on how like their usage or something um I kind of was just like listening from afar so I'm not exactly sure the whole conversation but they like started crying and like fighting and just all this stuff um and they had to get like the teachers involved and the head leader involved um and like some I think some school counselor actually came because they were so upset so it was um definitely interesting to see that like that's probably some sort of class issue that you know people that haven't been on it are making comments about like the stereotype and what they think it is um so that happened and then I've kind of talked about this before but again they were like threatening to give suspensions and stuff to students um and I've said this before, but that just shows, like, how those kids do get pushed into, like, getting suspended from school. And there's definitely a race issue going on with that in the school, like, that's more targeted towards black students, I think, um, from what I've seen on, like, who they threaten with them and who they give, like, their pink slips to. Um, so yeah, I've, I've talked about that a lot before, but um, that's definitely a big issue, I think, within, I don't know if like all boys and girls clubs, but, and I know that's kind of their only um, like discipline method, but still, if like they get suspended from that, it's like, where do they go after school? And, you know, they can't just go home to an empty house. Um, so then another thing, they did this project um, about surfers, and it was a about male surfers and female surfers and they were supposed to like write facts down about it um and so they actually separated the kids into a female group and a male group and the males like wrote about the males and the females wrote about the females so i just thought that was kind of like a big gender thing like you know why can't they learn about both genders and stuff like you don't have to separate that by gender i didn't think um so that was definitely kind of rough <laughs> it's like you're already like setting you know, a stereotype young that, like, females need to learn about females and males need to learn about males and, like, blah, 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 so, um, and then lastly, so, this kid, um, this is, like, another, uh, race thing, I think, but this kid got super mad and, like, pushed, um, another kid into the wall, like, during a game, and the teachers didn't do anything about it, and they, like, just be like hey don't do that like blah 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 but I feel like if a black student would have done that to either like a white student or another black student they like probably would have gotten suspended or at least gotten like a pink slip um just based off the way they like get them in trouble for things that are so much less than that um I feel like they definitely would have done more if it was a different race child um so that was just kind of interesting to see like they literally did not even care but I know if that was someone else they probably would have so those were some things that stuck out to me bye